seconds in. And who is going to get the jump on this? Well, that's a great start from Steger in the red jersey on the right-hand side of your screens. Puck Peterson in the blue jersey, right with her. Yeah, Steger also a good start. And this start lap actually is a bit different from uh, the original lap. So they turn right immediately down. And later they go to the left if they cross start finish line. And the purpose of that is just to thin them out a little bit. But it is Steger, the winner of the last round. And Peterson behind her making a case for themselves at the front of this one. Terpster is following them in third wheel. Evie Richards on fourth position. Evie the green, Richards. Uh, Tauber, Anna Tauber from the Netherlands on the fifth place in the green jersey. Evie Richards in that blue track factory racing Alessandra kit. Keller in the red, and then we have Pauline Fran Prevot in the rainbow jersey behind her. Keller just dropping a couple of bike lanes behind this leading pack, but they should bring them back together at the end of that start loop. Keller just getting down over the bars, stretching the back out a wee bit, letting the gradient do a bit of the work for her. Yeah, aerodynamic position, and also to stretch your legs, to get the oxygen back in the muscles. Short track can be a funny thing, Bart, can't it? It's good to be out front and in control, but you're also burning match. The Czech Republic, free to go now. She won the first four rounds uh, last year, cross country. Ferran Bravo leads him up the bottom of the climb, but Peterson, fancy you going to dig at this one. Yeah, we will see an attack very soon now. Only two, two laps to go. Alessandra Keller is controlling the race on the second place. You think she's looking good, Bart? Yeah, she's re looking really strong, yeah. She does. Haley Batten down 21st, just ahead of Lecomte. Valena Degen. Still no problems at all. Yeah. Peterson now in the, in the lead. Any landings, a good landing. Puck Peterson then. Dutch woman leads this one. Jenny Rusvids though, still looking like she's out for a Sunday coffee ride. Yeah, and also 80 points for a win here in the short track racing. D these points they count for the overall standings. Yeah, of Rebecca Hamilton with the white and yellow jersey. Martina Berta, the Italian champion there behind is, her. There is Henderson. The reigning Australian national champion, former UCI World Cup winner. There is still a little bit of time to move forwards, a little bit more to the front. Jenny Rusvids, her mouth is open now, it looks like she's now breathing. So, is she going to take control of this one and do a disappearing act on that 20 free bike? We see her for the first time now leading into this race. Yeah, Stiegel has to pay the price for the work, what she has done earlier into this race. A little bit of a gap right now, but wow, look at Rispets. Jenny Rispets. The 28-year-old, she loves this place, she loves Lenzerheide, she loves the Bike Kingdom. And yet again, is she riding her way to another win here? Six podiums, two times a winner. Final lap for these riders. Keller, second place, Pauline Ferrand-Provo behind her. And they need to close this gap down on this climb if they're going to want to rein back Jenny Rispets. To see where the other riders are. I tell you what, Bart, it's looking good for her. If Rispitz wins this, it has been a superb performance. She's looked imperious throughout. Yanni Rispitz now gritting the teeth. Keller still winching on, trying to get the gap down. I don't know if she's going to be able to do it though. Peterson riding behind the world champion. Pauline Ferran Bravo trying to zero in on Yanni Rispitz. Jenny Rispitz rounds the right-hander, and she is going to win. That trick for her. She is going to win her third here in Lanzarote. Bike Kingdom, Jenny Rispitz takes the win at the second round of the UCI Mountain Bike Cross Country Short Track World Cup. Jenny Rispitz, that is about as good a performance as I've seen from her for years, Bart. Yeah, what a performance. <laughs> I felt, I felt strong. Um, I was a little bit insecure when we had four laps to go, I think. I felt strong, but I thought the others also felt strong. But then I realized I was the fastest one through the woods. Um, so I just wanted to be in front there when we uh, came in for the, for the last lap and that worked. But the biggest smile of them all belongs to Jenny Risvids. Team 31, Ibis, Ryder, takes to the top step of the podium. 
for a third time in the short track in Lenzerheide. She loves this place. Risfeds from Keller, from Ferran Prevo. A superb race that held plenty of intrigue, but ultimately it was the Swede. Gibson there, could taste blood, her chest was burning. Here's confirmation of the results. Risfeds, Keller, Pauline Ferran Prevo in third place. Puck Peterson, fourth, Anna Tauber in fifth. Steger, Gibson, Fry, Terpstra, Henderson. 25 seconds covering the top 10. Absolutely nothing. Martina Berta, Kate Courtney, Evie Richards down in 13th. Then it was Berkey, Lecomte, Degen. Yannicka Loiv in 24th. Hayley Batten down in 26th. She'll have been hoping for more. <laughs> 